um reflex again here like i do nowadays my name is <laughs> well um i've been playing uh counter streak over 45 40 k hours around in general until 1.6 and uh, i improved like a lot into how to make configs and stuff nowadays in other games uh, so it's actually um for the game super people if you guys um want a really like competitive performance config where visibility and fps and like lag spikes um it like decreases a lot you're in the right video like i did the uh, own config for me so basically i started doing this in pubg nowadays like in in the back days when i was playing pubg i already have written a lot of this this is basically just like lowering the graphics lowering the distance rendering um, a lot like it's too much to tell you every single thing but it just will improve your overall gameplay because less lag spikes the more your aim will be of course like the more accurate it will um so yeah i made a config for you guys basically it just looks like this and this basically i have written it's basically a script uh here are my settings if you guys wanted i don't know if you really wanted i don't think so though um and here yeah scalability settings too basically just like you can read yourself loom quality live shift zero means off basically so like yeah it it explains itself uh fps i had a fps increase over 25 percent uh no 25 fps actually which is a lot for a game like this um because it's really bad optimized like people don't notice with high graphics but i've realized the game has so high uh lag spikes you can't just don't you don't really see these lag spikes because of all the fucking process uh, quality shit they had in the background so they kind of like try to hide it from people so you don't see actually that you have a lot of lag spikes while you're aiming so i made this config i know if you probably do it for the first time the game looks very like weird like a mobile game kind of but i'm telling you it's a competitive uh, uh, config and if you have problems to play with your friends because your fps is so low or you have problems on aiming in general this is the right config to go like i've been playing with settings like this until i was like a child uh, it, it's it's just normal for me nowadays to play on this i don't play games for graphics basically i just play them for fun so okay let's go into it all right so what you do is you open my config put it on your desktop it would be better to just coordinate and you click windows plus r so the windows key plus r then the ram pr uh, prompt uh, opens right so you can put in um app data like me here like just do the same i will put it in the description if you don't know how to do that uh okay all right then you basically just click on app data on the left top of the path here right then you go to local make sure to have the game open once at least right otherwise you can't change it another thing is with this config you can actually change to 4x3 if you can't change it in game that's another thing which Im will improve your um like in general like your fps so you go into bravo hotel game you see a file called bravo hotel game you go into save config windows client and then you see three folders okay two of them are very important one this one is also important but only one thing there basically right so what you do is you basically just do this like hold your control left click left click hold it hold your control put it in here okay or just drop it drop it in doesn't matter okay so it's actually in and then make sure if you drag it in replace the files in the destination otherwise it will be not in the destination all right so next what you're gonna do is Put your game user settings replace the file in the destination you click that i already have that uh so yeah you have set up this shit you don't need to change anything here the only thing you need to do is hold control or click 
one time on any single one of these two okay the engine one and the scalability one right click properties read only put read only a tick in otherwise the game will realize that and will override it okay and it's completely gone everything was for nothing then basically all right so you go in your game user settings um make sure to make a backup so you know all your sensitivity um in general like make sure you actually know your resolution what your resolution is because that's important right so so what you do is basically you basically the sensitivity you had in game okay this is the general sensitivity is the the hip fire the free look how you turn normal without anything right click or anything all right the aos sensitivity is your ads sensitivity peaking with the shoulder and the total sensitivity is basically the overall ads sensitivity okay so the only thing you need to change is change this on your hip fire change this on your ads both of these i would recommend putting that on the same amount because it is stupid if you put something on the shoulder different like your ads it makes no sense right so you have everything here set up okay and then okay if you want to play a custom resolution whatever your custom resolution is if it's 1280 by 1080 1600 by 1080 whatever right minus 1440 by 1080 so what you put here resolution size x you see it here uh so you basically put like minus 1440 by 1080 so you put 1440 and y 1080 same here 1440 y 1080 okay desired screen width okay 1440 1080 whatever your custom res is put that in minus 1440 i hope you understand it okay last user confirmed the side screen with same 1440 by 1080 all right we got that that's it pretty much then you just click si uh, file save on the left top probably you don't have notepad but just save the file right uh the rest don't change the graphic settings it will not work with the config otherwise it will have lag spikes etc if you're really looking for the best competitive settings there is no better one than this you see more you, you basically everything the only thing if someone knows uh why some scopes in the game are bloomy when you scope in it probably has something to do with some of these comments i'm not sure what it is but i don't really care because i still have more fps than everyone and less leg spikes so it doesn't that matter that much to me i just play the game for fun anyway um so yeah basically if you've done this make sure to right click read only okay make sure the tick is in here otherwise you will fuck up your everything okay and after that make sure to copy this make a folder right and call it backup and paste that shit in so you have a backup yeah and that's pretty much it uh the game will look similar like this i can show you i'm trying to find where i played this game i think it was somewhere here yeah so the game will look like this kind of if you look close like i'm pretty pretty good in this game like i literally played like i think 10 hours or something like the recall and shit is hard i know that for a fact right but the recall is weird as fuck in this game like the first bullets are accurate then it goes straight up in there like so weird with this config you have will have less legs back so will you will hit enemies better yeah this guy was a hacker but i wrecked him because i played too much matchmaking in cs <laughs> well so the game will look like this so you can see like everything is way more visible of course the game looks a little bit weird right but everything is more clear because you have less contrast you have less textures you have no shadows right your leg, sp leg spikes will completely be gone almost like there will be no leg spiking between your mouse input 
so it's not gonna be like a big of a deal to play with these settings i think for someone like um but yeah if you enjoyed this video make sure to give me the thumbs up in the video if you want more videos like this in the future if i should make in more games um like performance guides config guides and make for you guys a lot of configs where you basically just own people like competitive settings for the future of the pro scene maybe because i can do that for sure like that's not a problem for me i've been making configs since i was like five and a half years old i'm literally 23 almost i'm turning 23 in like three months so well i hope you guys enjoy it give me the thumbs up and maybe comment if you have any questions or you like the video just comment something right uh, so i can see like feedback or something whatever right and yeah enjoy